What's up YouTube? This is James coming back at you with another informative video. Hope everybody's doing well out there on this hot Tuesday. 95 degrees over here. You understand? And it's pretty hot. <laughs> but other than that, I'm doing pretty good. Look, as we know in this country, the police, the lot of the police, you know, uh, not only racist, evil, murdering, you know, or what have you. But as we know, they also rape. And um, they get to the point to now where um, they're frisking the women. The male police are actually frisking the women when there used to be a time that they were actually calling another female officer, you see, to frisk the women. But now the men are taking it up, up on themselves to frisk the women. And uh, the thing is, is this. Well, these uh, male officers are uh, overstepping their bounds, as in this particular case right here. It says, Austin police officer caught sexually assaulting woman. Graphic video. There's a 15 second uh, video, you know, that they have here. Uh, I saw, okay, as you can see right here in this uh, picture. Well, he did run his hands across her breasts. He's not supposed to do that. So uh, we're going to go through this article right here. And then at the end of the article, we're going to check out the video. Okay. Now let's get into this. It says here an awesome police officer is being accused of sexually assaulting a woman he was arresting. MTO News has learned the male officer can be seen on video rubbing the woman's breast as her hands are cuffed behind her. Behind her. The woman immediately protests and asks to have a female officer arrest her or search her but the officer ignores her request and continues to grope and handcuff woman luckily a passerby recorded the incident and posted the video online the video has since gone viral and has seen more than well has been seen more than uh two million times yeah that bastard see that, that he's not supposed to do this man these i'm telling you these cops here in this country are nothing but criminals with badges that's just all there is to it um, in conclusion here, it says MTO News reached out to the Austin Police Department and asked whether they approve of the officer's aggressive and possible predatory behavior. The APD told MTO News that they were looking into the incident. Recently, the Austin City Council voted unanimously to ban tear gas and reduce the amount of military equipment given to police to the greatest extent possible. The resolution also updated the department's use of force policy, banning it on people fleeing in a vehicle or on foot. Oh, you mean banning them, shooting them in the back if they taking off on, on foot, you know, which they didn't, you don't have to do. Um, to continue, it says here, it stopped the use of beating, well, excuse me, it stopped the use of beanbag rounds, rubber bullets, or other less than lethal uses of force unless a person possessing an immediate threat of death or serious bodily harm the resolution did not address whether police can sexually violate its citizens that goes without saying we know that they're not supposed to do no shit like that i'm telling you here's what it comes down to as we know um here in this country and especially the black community we need to police ourselves we need to police ourselves because we got criminals with badges that's coming in here like i said earlier on in in this uh uh, uh commentary here uh, we got criminals with badges coming in the community murdering you know raping stealing probably even using uh well distributing drugs at this point see they think they can do what the hell they want to do but uh yeah there's some changes coming down the pike and uh, it's, it's not with this so-called fake-ass uh, police reform. You know, there's going to be some changes made. And it's going to be changes on behalf of the people that come together to do it. And when that happens, road cops can forget it. So, uh, let's check out this 15-minute uh, this, uh, video. And uh, we'll see what you think from there. Get a female officer in here now. She's fucking getting 
He did it again. Look at this shit. Yeah, he's doing it. He did it again. <laughs> this bastard. Check out his left hand first. Y'all check out his left hand. See that? Yeah, these road cop, these road rapist ass cops, man. I'm telling you, this this has got to this has got to stop. This has got to stop. See, this is what happens when the people fall asleep and put their trust in um, the government. Basically, this is a branch of the government. Law enforcement is. Uh, this is what happens. You know, they're just they're they're just doing too much, man. You know, and uh, they got to be put in their place. You know, the only damn thing that divides them and defines them from the average criminal running the road is the badge and the gun. That's it. That's all it boils down to. Other than that, they're doing the same shit that other people that they claim criminals are doing out here. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this story right here. I'm interested in hearing y'all thoughts and views and opinions on it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. People, please remember to live your life as though we are being watched. Simply because we are, this is James and I'm out. Peace.